Hi everyone, today I'm going to do a Primark haul. Now I've been in Primark twice this week because I'm trying to keep an eye out for the metallic rucksack or backpack that they've had all over their Instagram page and Facebook page. So if you know any store in Kent that has that, please let me know because I can't find it anywhere. But in the process of that, you can't not go into Primark and not buy anything. So I'm going to start with the necklaces I got in the sale. I got two necklaces in the sale. First one is this one here. It was meant to be £3, I got it for two. Bargain. I love thick, chunky statement necklaces. I think they brighten up any top, dress up any top, they go with dresses, they go with a lot of things and they can really like change up an outfit. So the only thing that annoys me about this one is it separates just there. But um you know once it's on I'm sure you won't notice. The second one I got is a little bit simpler, it is this one here, it is just silver, nothing fancy, a little silver bar with a little black block detail there, and as you can see there, it was meant to be £1.50, I got it for 50p. That was probably the, the best bargain to be honest, 50p for a necklace, you can't go wrong, even if I decide I don't like it in two, three weeks. Who cares? 50p. Also in the sale, I've got two t-shirts. Now, I'm a big Harry Potter fan, so when I found both these t-shirts were a pound each, I couldn't not pick them up. First one, Harry there. Can't be a bit of Harry. And the second one, again, exactly the same. Oh, sorry about the noise. Exactly the same, but Ron. Now, these t-shirts have got a size bigger because, to be honest, I probably wear them as pyjama tops. But, um, you never know, I might wear them out. Um, if I go back to Florida, that would be perfect. So that is those. The last thing I brought in the sale, which it probably should have hung up because it would be easier to show you guys, is this flowery, I suppose it's a, um, kimono, but, um... It's a lot thicker and a lot um, more sort of like a woolly material, so it's sort of like half cardigan, I suppose. It's got a lovely print on it, which I'll hold up a bit to the camera so you can get a um, nice... Yep, and it's got some gorgeous tassels at the bottom. That was meant to be... £14. I don't know if that will be able to focus. Probably not. But yeah, it's meant to be £14. I got it for a pound. So £13 off. I couldn't not pick it up. I was trying to get hold of this all summer last year and it kept going out of stock. So I was absolutely ecstatic when I found that in the sale. Now, the next thing I've got is not marked up as sale, but I went in with my sister and she, it's the only thing she brought. And it was. Um, three three pound yeah three pound um when she took it to the till they only charged her one so obviously i couldn't resist so i picked one up as well and yep they're all marked up as three pound but when they scan them they are one so if something like that takes your fancy then i next thing is disney and me right you're probably thinking oh my god this woman or this girl is about five because all of the stuff I'm showing you is Harry Potter or Disney and again I've got more Disney and Harry Potter stuff in the background but these slippers they are the cutest thing ever and they are the warmest softest things ever they are were £8 I think they're £8 full price some prime up because they're obviously slippers for winter have got them marked down to five I think so yeah these are the cutest well must haves for me they had Minnie and Mickey but they just weren't as cute as these uh, next thing is a new purse now I should really be using this right now but I had to save it so I could do this haul it is like 
since the colour's grey, but to be honest, it's more of like a, a duck egg sort of bluey colour. It's got lovely sort of like crocodile skin pattern there and some really cute like metal flowery lacy patterned corners. I need purses that have huge change pouches on them and um, lots of card pockets because nowadays every shop you need a card in Superdrug boots, Matalan, God knows what else. And I work as a waitress so I get a lot of change in tips. So I need a nice big pocket for all my change. So this one ticks all the boxes. It's not a normal colour that I'd usually go for, to be honest, but um, something about this one just screamed to me. So yeah, this was £5, so again, really good price. The last time I bought a purse it was River Islands, I think it was 17 so only a fraction of the price really. And my last thing is the thing that I love the most, and it is these these sunglasses I saw these again on the Instagram page and I really really wanted them so I went out and got them I don't really go with how my hair is or whatever today but who cares I don't even know if they suit me to be honest but I love these these were £3 yeah £3 from Primark so again they've got some really good sunnies at the minute I'm, I was really tempted to buy these in the sort of um, leopard print tortoise shell pattern as well for, for £3 you can't you can't complain really, can you? So, yeah, I'll probably end up with another pair of these. It's not sunny enough near me to be wearing these right now, but don't care. Need them there for a backup or, you know, a nice sunny day in the park, a bit of sun bathing. Um, but, yeah, hopefully I'll get to use them at some point this summer. Fingers crossed. I think that is everything. Yes, that is that is everything. Um, now, my goal at the minute, or my motivation to help me lose weight, is I save the tips I earn all week at work, and then I go out on the Saturday if I've lost weight, and I spend them. So hopefully you'll get a lot more hauls like this, or maybe other sort of just general shopping trips, or clothing, or fashion hauls and stuff that I get, or maybe even makeup ones, because I've been looking a lot more into makeup as well. So... Um, if that's something you're interested in, please hit my like button and subscribe, and I'll see you all soon. Bye! Hello everyone! Woo <laughs> On... Actually, let me just check my focus. Okay. So, in case. So, and... Don't really know where I'm going with this. Right, twice. Let's stop rattling that around. Bargain? Um, yeah, I'm too close to the camera, aren't I? Yeah. For one pound. A pound, yes, a pound. There you go. To be honest, I'm not sure I like it. Yeah, to find this is making a lot of noise. You, you can see that there on the. No, you can't. There was a guy with this. Um, yeah. That shouldn't even be there, right? Recommend these. I don't recommend them. What the fuck? I don't recommend them.